And yeah, I'm Andy, and we're back in Grim Fandango, and we're just going to continue right where we left off and try and get a work order signed. So let's uh, talk to the not receptionist lady. What is that horrible uh, squeaking noise you're making? New shoes. Is my balloons making noise? Huh. Alright, let's go to our inventory and get that work order. So let's see. I think that's it's some sort of special yeah, work order. We'll also look that, and then we'll uh, give that to her. Oh, Manny! Just take the sentences one word at a time. You'll get it. To all agents. All right, you boneheads! Thank you, lucky stars, and get to your friggin' cars. We have a mass poisoning on our too many dead to assign specific case. So let's see some. Wait, what? Whatever you say, Iffy. Did I get the wrong work order? Uh. Uh. All right, there it is. Uh, it wasn't the work order. It was the. Uh... I get this yeah, it is the work order. order. I just got the wrong work order. So. What a way to start, right? Um, so yeah, let's just select that and get that to her. If I really need the boss to sign this work order... I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, Mr. Calavera has something out here that he says he needs his signature on. Ah, oh, great, Ava! Just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy! You'll have to excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crossword puzzle he's got in there today. Yeah, a crossword puzzle. Eva, I'm impressed. I had no idea you had this kind of power. Well, we all have our secrets. That's a lot of bow ties on her shirt. Say black is slimming. I'm driving! Yeah! I'm driving! That was super uncomfortable. <laughs> and super unsafe. Por favor. I could have walked faster than this. Uh, híjole, I'm gonna miss the poisoning. Yeah, but he said you didn't want to walk in the freeway. What? This is the land of the living. Domino. This is the weird. living still give me the creeps. Everything's all. It's like the, you, uh, the those ransom letters where all the things were cut up from magazines. All the letters. It's something like this, so uh, let's see. This is trippy. Look at these poor saps. Smiles as bright and wide as the blade on my scythe. Can I eat In this? this world, all I can do is look, smell, and reap. Okay, so I can't eat that. I can't carry the whole package out of here. He's got to shuffle off his mortal coil. Then we can split. Hmm. I can't use my bare hands. I'm a professional. Uh, so if I'm a reaper, guess I'll use my reaper. Do they even see me? They're just there. Nice bathroom. That was fast. <laughs> but we offer several travel package upgrades if you care to cut the yap. I want something cheap where I can get some rest, and that's it. Ay, ay, ay. You know, Manny, I could make this car a little faster if you wanted. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Oh, yeah. Slam the front into the weed. Tub the rear end. Two blowers pop it out of the hood. Wow, 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 wow. 
You'll get okay. plenty of rest this way, Mr. Martinez, and you'll be safely padded by the foam created when these two chemicals mix like this. Oh, second thought, I want to upgrade my package. Sorry, Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary mug. No, First wait. day of the end of your life. Can't you find me something where I can move my legs? You know I'd like to, Bruno, but my boss is a real hard ass. I gotta be a hard ass when I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. I got a sale right here. I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. How am I supposed to make premium sales with the scumbag clients you're sending me? Hey, now you're <laughs> blaming the clients? I've had it with you, Manny. If you haven't bagged a premium before the next sales report comes in, you're out. Out on the street, no job, no way to work off your time. Just your fancy suit and your big smile and a whole lot of time to kill. Who you calling a scumbag? Why well, I ought not. <laughs> I'm sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick. It's time to take one. Okay. So where am I supposed to go? Probably my office? Not to the garage. Well... Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. Of course. So yeah, I should go to my office, I think. Hmm. I should close Bruno's record before the black mark burn into my screen. So where am I supposed to go? Here? At least I didn't see him. Well, before. at least you're not hitting the bottle anymore. Hey, Kelly, how you doing? So, how'd you make out of the poisoning? Well, let's just say that Sister Calabaza has a secret passion. For trains. You got a nun? Hail Mary. And you sold her a ticket on the number nine train. Choo choo, little buddy. Say, how'd you score? I got a mean midget I had to send parcel post. Ah, cheer up, buddy. Another day, another death. Am I right? Hmm. I want to ask you a question. Shoot, slugger. Why do you get all the good clients? You're asking the wrong guy. You should be taking a good long look at the man in the mirror. No thanks. I don't enjoy that the same way you do. Can I have one of your clients? Sure, Cal. Just as soon as I get one I think you could handle. I can handle anything you got. Especially if that's your best right jab. <laughs> well, that's all I wanted to I ask. I don't want to antagonize him. Well, kid, come back anytime. Well... Oh, that's great. We should do this more well, maybe often. Should, should I? Since he's by, uh... Hey, Hurl. Uh, let me yeah. Try Let's try that. I want to punch you in the mouth. Oh, no. Not the <laughs> Christmas party all over again. What happened at the Christmas party? Blacked out on the whole thing, huh? Maybe you should switch to lemonade, kid. Well... Oh, that's great. We should do this more often. All right, so I'm not supposed to, I mean, the goal is not here, so I think, uh, is it over here? Guess not, so, I think I'm lost, so I'm just trying to go to all the available places. So 
let's go back down to the lobby. I'll never get out of this place. Wait, huh? uh, you and your fancy suits and your nose holes way up in the air, sticking your empty beer bottles down the message tubes. How fancy is that? Huh? Don't you boys upstairs realize the tube switcher is a sophisticated and delicate piece of machinery? Huh? You think you're better than me? No. Good. Um, okay. So can I go to that new room? Or oh, man, that, that that angle is like disorienting. It's like one way, it's one way, but then the other way is the other. I I don't know. All right, we're in a different room. Can I grab that fire extinguisher? I can. Ooh. Alright, I stored it, so what can I do with this? That red tube looks familiar. So that red tube looks Not familiar. Making that up. Not picking that up. The wheel won't turn and the door won't budge. Sophisticated and delicate than myself. Hmm. What can I do? I got my scythe, got my playing cards, balloon, deflated balloon, balloon, another deflated balloon, and a fire extinguisher. So let's see, can I use the balloon? It's a deflated balloon. That's not what balloons are for. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so... What can we do? I guess we can go over here. I don't think I've been here before. Uh, except from the, from the cutscene, so... One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. Alright, so what, I remember that both of these will combine and do something. For those who enjoy no-hassle travel. Alright, so I think... Can I... Can I, can, can I like contain the fluids? Or whatever, whatever substance with the balloons? Let's try. It's a deflated balloon. Alright, I got Mr. Zucchini over there, and let's uh, fill the other one. Alright, Mr. Zucchini part 2. Alright, what's that? I didn't even notice that statue. Now this guy. I don't know who this guy is. I think he just paid for the lobby renovation. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's uh, go back up to our office and try and sabotage. I think that's what I'm supposed to do, considering... Uh, there's something that has to do with the two holders, because that's... He made a mention of that. And I keep turning. <laughs> Alright, what's in my inventory? I got Mr. Zucchini part one, so let's uh, do that. Put that in there. Well, that. <laughs> <laughs> Look out below. Alright, 
it, so we need the other one. I still don't know why I have the other two things. So, Mr. Zucchini, part two. <laughs> and yes, I know zucchinis are green, but it is what it is. So let's go back down. There are purple zucchinis. Or uh, eggplants, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying here. Server's down again. What else is new? So let's go back down and see what happens. Yeah, that that's really disorienting. Cause like you're going this way and you're facing the other way, but then uh, when you go this way, you're walking the other way. It's, it's really confusing. So. Let's talk to this person. Hi, I'm not getting any messages. Is the server down? This is their idea of a joke? They think it's funny? I'd like to jam their tubes with packing material. See how they like that? So you're saying the server is down, is that it? The server is not down. It's never down. It's just temporarily unavailable while I'm doing some maintenance, that's all. Well, I gotta well, split. I need to check before I tinker with that, so... Can I move? Oh! Not again! Ah, 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 ah. You tried to blow this joint sky high? That's a magnesium compound fire extinguisher! Spray that on this packing foam, and we'll both be riding the giant Roman candle out of here! What? Why would they put something so dangerous in here? I guess they didn't expect this room to be full of hazardous waste! Hmm. Can I activate that? I guess I can. I've just locked so. an open door. <laughs> Strange, yet symbolically compelling. All right, so let's talk to the, opponent, the person again. So, uh, who would do a I terrible thing like this? It's those punks in the mailroom. They think this baby is going to put them out of a job, and they're right. Just curious, how'd you get in there? I squeezed out one of these tubes like a pixie. How do you think I got in here? Through the door, just like you. Well, I got a split. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I got an achievement. I squeezed down one of those tubes like a pixie. Okay, so I guess you get achievements by getting certain people to say certain things or something. Enough for government work. Hey, good thing we locked in from the outside. All right, so I walked out and he walked out, but I don't see him walking out. Okay. Knock yourself out. <laughs> Thanks. Gets the aggressions out, doesn't it? Hey, I got another achievement. Uh, gets the aggressions out, does it? I didn't even know. 
Okay, so there are a lot of uh, weird achievements, but I guess that's something. So let's see. It's a hole puncher. Uh, can we? I don't want to hole punch a balloon. I don't. I certainly don't want to hole punch a fire extinguisher. Can we hole punch these type of cards? Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. Or I guess we can just do uh... a. Hmm. So I guess we can uh, do more hole punching with the candy. Any more holes and it would fall apart. Let's just do put that back. Hmm, what else do we go? Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. Hey, Hurl. Yeah. I just wanted to. Oh, that's great. We should do this more. There's no new dialogue here. So let's. I mean, we punched a card, so that's something. Yeah, that, this hallway is really weird. It's really disorienting. I don't know if that's uh, happened to anyone too other well. Like, I'm sorry, I'm not uh, providing that much comfort there because they're, they're talking. Uh, can we open this? Yes, we can. Because, like, they're providing all the commentary or all the talking, so. Alright, what can we do? Mercedes Colomart, light number 9308, blah blah blah, died of chicken pox, time of death, yada yada yada. Aha, positive attributes, volunteered time reading stories to dying children. Okay. That's good, that's really good. I think you're it, Mercedes Colomar. I think you're the one for me. Gladys, are you loco? What got into you? Wow, was a that's a souped up oh, car. Yeah. <laughs> and it's even better company now. I'm in. Yeah. Well then. Buenos dias. You're not the nurse? No. You're not here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? No, but there's still a chance you could save me. That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calavera. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche, I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. Hmm. Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering I've told you nothing. Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. Never killed anybody? I have to confess, I never killed anybody. Not even a teensy bit of killing? <laughs> Maybe I just wasn't trying hard enough. Ever cheated on your taxes? I've never paid taxes in my life. Aha! Uh -huh. I've never made enough money to be taxed. <laughs> you know, it's mostly been all volunteer work. Uh-huh. Mean to animals? Oh no, I love animals. Once, when I was volunteering at an animal shelter, I... Just stop right there. Litter? Oh, man, is that the best you can do? Well, let's try that one. Me, Give me some dirt. 
Well, I could do something bad right now, if that would help. <laughs> Wouldn't count. Sorry. Ever cheated on your husband? Mr. Calavera, there's no ring on my finger. There's no skin on it either. I guess you'll just have to trust me then. Were you That's a big shoplifter? Well, they accused me of it once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. <laughs> oh, I give up. Don't say that, Manny. All right. Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? Sure. sure. Where is it? It's wherever you guys put my skin. <laughs> Excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble, but please, call me Manny. Hey, I got another achievement. So I guess I'm gonna end it here because I'm running out of time. So I guess I'm gonna do like 20 to 30 minutes per... because I don't know how long this game is, but it's getting really interesting. Like, I think I'm getting the hang of the puzzles and... At least, I i mean, aside from the beginning, I got lost, but I don't think I got lost after that, so hopefully the next few episodes won't be me being lost. So, yeah, uh, let's uh, not do that. Let's save. Alright, save game, not new game, slot 2. And double check, uh, slot 2 is my office, yep. So yeah, so far it's been really interesting. We got a new souped up car. We got a new client, but apparently there's something wrong about her or something wrong with my computer. So I think I'll have to talk to the boss and see what's wrong. But, but anyways, until next time, thank you for watching and have a nice day.